I knew business was deep, but playing the Alan Gray, it literally blew my mind. It expanded on my knowledge. Entrepreneurship is the way forward. People need to learn how to earn their own income. There's a huge need for people to be able to come up with their own ideas, to drive those ideas and stimulate the economy in the country. Obviously the current learners are very much in the digital world. They want to do everything on their phones or on their laptops. And if you can introduce technology in a fun way, you have immediate buy-in. It is the way forward and I think this game, in a very fun way, highlights the importance of running your own business. I was really surprised about how good the game was. I chose education. I definitely liked uh, the fintech. I chose the financial industry. The business I started was an app that gave information on illnesses and cures for them. It was definitely like exciting to be able to hire people because that's something teenagers like us normally wouldn't be able to do. It was a bit stressful at times whether you click this option or you click this option. There were challenges where they had to communicate with staff as well. I thought, no, I can't talk to people. I'm not a people's person. I do not have that quality. But I think this game brought out to me that I actually can. What is very, very important is your first impression to your customers. Picking the right parameters to get the right results. It was very interesting. It felt like a bit like a puzzle. And it was cool to have that challenge of trying to get the numbers just right. The challenge did give quite a few learners a very good idea of this is what I learned in the classroom, but this is how it's applied in the real world. My favorite thing in the entire game was doing the marketing campaign. I see marketing as getting people to see your vision as a business owner. And when marketing is successful, it means that people see your vision, they see your dreams, they see why they should buy your product. We analyzed the age groups, what type of media they would like us to advertise on. I just had to do what my market was telling me that they prefer. You just see all the zeros, you get really excited. The amount of money I made was about 1.9 million. Each week is like a year in the actual business world so you understand what a proper CEO would go through in the business world. They'll learn about the different pricing strategies and think, do I go for a high price, make a, a higher profit or a low price? I was a bit worried of not generating a profit, but I actually surprised myself because I landed up hiring the right people, did the right marketing campaign, I did land up generating a massive profit. I say to them, whatever decision you make is important because you're going to have to stick by that decision. When I first started my business, my goal was to make a profit. But as I continued the journey, I realized that there are many other goals too. To make sure your employees are happy, honesty, trust, and a successful, honest business. I've gained so much knowledge on the corporate world and all its inner mechanisms have to make sure that you make the choices good for your business but also for everyone in your business. It showed all the different risk factors that you have to take in place. You have to know what you're doing. And I would keep encouraging them and reminding them that it is possible, we can do this. With the business you always want to aspire to expand it. Analyzing the data helped me in realizing if it'd be better staying a small company or going to greater heights. To be able to put it out in front of the public was like a really exciting experience. 
learners are very excited to get the challenge because now for the first time you, they become CEOs. Being the own CEO of my company and hiring my own employees was a little bit stressful but also eye-opening. I had lots of power. It forced me to be responsible. I also learned new skills and information that can help me in the future. I got to make all of the important decisions about how to run the business. One slip up could cause everything to fall. I think it's a very cool feeling because it's been five weeks of having to go through the process, following it online, um, taking part, and to know that the hard work has paid off is very cool. I think it will motivate me and like encourage me that I actually can do something that's meaningful in my life. It means a lot to me because I didn't expect getting as high as I did. It just shows me that hard work can pay out. I've gained more confidence in perhaps pursuing a degree. I finally had something that I was really happy about and this gave me a feeling of more self-worth. We are extremely proud of Shikara's efforts. Her dedication and hard work has certainly paid off. It really inspires you. You can start your own business in the real world. It's not necessarily a simulation. You can make that kind of thing happen. I would encourage any parents to encourage their children to participate in a competition like this. They can only grow as a result of it. Sometimes people battle with their self-belief and if you can achieve in a competition like this, it shows that you can achieve wherever you want. And I really hope that uh, many more will take up the challenge, will compete against each other, that we will get some really excellent ideas coming forward.